residents who are citizens of Wisconsin's tribal nations, and of course, the ancestors of the land we're on. Uh, I also acknowledge being meeting here today on the uh, on the land of the Ojibwe and Menominee tribes, and uh, I have to thank all of you for, uh, especially the tribal members, um, your uh, your work and being stewards of the land. Uh, I have uh, I have I have made the year 2019 the year of the water, uh, clean water. <laughs> I appreciate that, but the tribal nations have had that year of the water forever. <laughs> and so it, we have so much to learn from you. I was actually with the uh, uh, the Water Council in Milwaukee yesterday, a group, group of folks that work on water issues, and uh, I was telling them we have a lot to learn from the tribal nations and their, their uh, the, the cultural and spiritual relevance of having clean water and honoring that going forward. So I, I just want to let you know I continue to pri prioritize our state's dedication to the tribal nations and believe that when we work together, we are stronger. Uh, I know there are unique challenges facing Native American communities, and which speaks to the focus of this conference of 12 nations, two worlds, and one people. Uh, as I told the tribal leaders a few weeks ago, uh, when uh, at, after the State of the Tribes uh, address, uh, as governor, I'm deeply committed to being a strong partner to the Wisconsin tribes. I'm committed to work to ensure that the uh, Native peoples have the adequate resources moving forward. And I, I actually signed a, an executive order that day with all the tribal leaders and reaffirmed the state's commitment to sovereign, the sovereignty of the tribal nations and also ensuring some things on our behalf, on, on the, the government's behalf. behalf. We are going to ensure that all state employees, not just those at the Department of Public Instruction, but all state employees are educated on tribal nations and their sovereignty. We are also strengthening our day-to-day -day working relationships between tribal and state government agencies. We're going to pro provide at least one annual meeting uh, for each agency with tribal leaders. And each state agency and uh, Wisconsin state agency will have one staff member to serve as a liaison between the, the, uh, the state of Wisconsin and the tribal nations.